Hi guys, it's Tristan from World English School. And today I'm gonna to read you the fourth chapter from Frog and Toad Together. And this story is called Dragons and Giants on page 42. So let's take a look. Dragons and Giants. Frog and Toad were reading a book together. The people in this book are brave, said Toad. They fight dragons and giants and they are never afraid. I wonder if we are brave, said Frog. Frog and Toad looked into a mirror. We look brave, said Frog. Yes, but are we? Asked Toad. See, he's got a fairy tales book there. Are they brave? Frog and Toad went outside. We can try to climb this mountain, said Frog. That should tell us if we are brave. Frog went leaping over rocks and Toad came puffing up behind him. They came to a dark cave. A big snake came out of the snave, <laughs> out of the cave. <laughs> Hello, lunch, said the snake when he saw Frog and Toad. He opened his mouth wide. Frog and Toad jumped away. Toad was shaking. I am not afraid, he cried. Wow. Is this a dream or did they really see a snake? Well, they are frog and toad, right? So they're pretty small. So this is probably real, right? They really saw a snake. They climbed higher and they heard a loud noise. Many large stones were rolling down the mountain. It's an avalanche, cried Toad. Frog and Toad ran away. Frog was trembling. I am not afraid, he shouted. They came to the top of the mountain. The shadow of a hawk fell over them. Frog and Toad jumped under a rock. The hawk flew away. We are not afraid, screamed Frog and Toad. <laughs> then they ran down the mountain very fast. They ran past the place where they saw the avalanche. They ran past the place where they saw the snake. They ran all the way to Toad's house. Frog, I am glad to have a brave friend like you, said Toad. He jumped into the bed and pulled the covers over his head. And I am happy to know a brave person like you, Toad, said Frog. He jumped into the closet and shut the door. <laughs> Toad stayed in the bed and Frog stayed in the closet. They stayed there for a long time, just feeling brave together. Isn't that funny? The last story is called The Dream. And that was called Dragons, what was it again? Dragons and, Dragons and Giants. And the Giants were the bird and the, or the, the eagle and the snake and the, the, uh, the avalanche. I guess they were all giants to them, the frog and toad. And the dragons were, well, in their imagination, because they didn't really see a dragon, did they? But I guess they imagined it. I want to show you around here a little bit. This is called uh, A.B. River. And this is kind of a nice place. There's the bridge called Funabashi Bridge right there. And then you can see the river a little bit here. It's a windy, windy day. Anyway, this is kind of the famous uh, river in my city. It's not very big, but it's still pretty. I like it. There's some birds up there. Anyway, thanks for watching and see you for the last story of Frog and Toad together.